Fifth graders, welcome back. So for our next assignment, you're going to be drawing your hand. So first thing I would like you to do is trace the outline of your hand. Just doesn't have to be perfect. Just something quick and simple like that. Then, inside of your hand, you're not going to color it like normal. You're only going to use the color black and you're going to use something called a, a Zentangle pattern. So, this is the word I would like you to look up. Z-E-N-T-A-N-G-L-E. -E. <coughs> Excuse me. And you can see there's lots of different kinds of designs when you look up that word. So, I printed out a bunch of examples. So there are lots and lots of different styles that you can do for this. So uh, those of you at home, just uh, look it up and just find a couple of uh, designs that seem interesting to you. And just go through them kind of quickly and there, there's like lots of different styles everybody should probably look a little bit different so what you're going to do like we see here at this hand right here we have lots and lots of different uh, designs inside of the hand So we have these swirls, we have these like zigzag lines, uh, they even did pattern inside of their nails. Uh, this looks like there's a ring right there. This looks like a piano, the uh, piano keys right here. This kind of looks like the sun and like flames coming out. These designs right here look really, really nice. Our next hand example, uh, she even put her name inside of the petal of a flower and just it could be a little bit simple or you can get very detailed completely up to you. This one's really interesting, has a flower, has this really big eyeball right here, has a heart over here, lots of details which is I, which I love to see. Another really good example. This one had lots of uh, really great designs. Uh, this one has hearts, this one has stars, this one has lots of vines and leaves. And so that's what your assignment. Uh, if you want to get a little bit more advanced, or if you want to do something a little bit extra, like you get really inspired by this, uh, some artists do uh, that Zentangle uh, style, and instead of doing it just in their hands, they do animals as well, like this fish right here, this butterfly right here. head of any animals you would like. Uh, so if you get inspired and want to do a little bit extra, uh, you can also look up what kind of different uh, animals do, uh, people have done. But again, those of you at home, please look up this word so you can get some different styles and designs and inspiration. So uh, if you have any questions about this project, uh, feel free to join one of my uh, Zoom lessons and uh, ask all the questions that you need to clarify anything. Uh, this is for a grade, so please make sure that you uh, take a picture of your final product and turn it in. I can't wait to see what y'all come up with. Thanks for watching.